Good morning, Good morning, everyone. Welcome to day three in Lisbon. Today we're doing the vinyl, vinyl adventure. adventure. We are going to go to maybe three or four shops and look at their vinyl that they have in Lisbon. And in between, we're going to go to a delicious spot for lunch, but we'll tell you about that later. So follow us and get ready for a great day. So we just left Floor Records and we picked out a record mm -hmm. um, and they ha mostly had new records and a mm -hmm. small selection of used records and we found a record by Oito. Oito is a Portuguese uh, duo and they had, it was kind of like a yeah. uh, acid jazz like record that used old samples of um, classic Portuguese music. Okay, so now we're about to head to record shop number two. It's called Tobato Records, and I'm really looking forward to checking out what they have there. We just finished shopping in Tobato, and I really liked it. They had a really nice selection of African music and that was my first experience really seeing that many different countries represented and different artists. And it's better than just like the small world music section that I'll find sometimes in the States. We just left our two record shops, um, Floor and Tabato, but we're really hungry so we're taking a lunch break. We are at Cantina do Aziz. It's a Mozambique restaurant with a woman head chef. We just had a really good lunch and we took a little detour on our way to our final record shop, Louie Louie. We're at the Miradora de Grasa and we walked up a bunch of steps that had very cool street art and it was really beautiful. We stopped so much to take pictures and just take in the sights. I stopped a lot because I was tired. <laughs> We are finally at this Fado mural that we've been hearing about. I thought we were lost because we definitely were. We found another Fado related like picture tour. And then after Nate just started walking around, I had no idea where we were going. We ended up here. <laughs> So we just left the last record place, which was Louie Louie, and we are tired. Yeah, we bought a few records. I bought two small ones, and Nate bought one big one at Louie Louie, and we need a break. So we ended up at the oldest bookstore in the world. Um, I already forgot the name, but we'll put it, the, the name below. Um, we're tired. How many steps did we walk? Uh, we walked 22,000 steps. <laughs> yeah, I, it's just time to sit down. <laughs> baby beer and I drink a lot of beer it's still really good 
I got the blondie from this really cool spot that Nate and I had heard about called Musa. It's an independent craft beer, I guess. It's an, ind it's an independent craft beer place and they have a lot of nice options. And the people there are really nice too. I love a craft beer place and I found this place in Lisbon who, as far as I know, is not known for craft beer, but it's this place called Musa, and they offered this cute little box, and I got a four-pack of different beers from like an IPA to Saison, and uh, it would make a great gift, but I think I'm gonna drink them all. <laughs>